Attention all units, a possible stolen vehicle. Proceed with caution. Alright everyone, we are back at you with another video. Um, I've done it again. Uh, we got the Mobile County Sheriff's Office. Um, actually, these are 2016 Ford Tauruses. Um, I've just created both of these two. So I just want to come showcase them out real quick. Um, I did make two of them. In one is going to be with light bar and one is going to be without. So... Um, this one right here is more based off the Mobile County Sheriff's Office. Be familiar with the Mobile, Alabama area. Uh, Mobile County. Deputies drive these vehicles here. So um, I added a little flood light to the front right there. Um, it does have ion lights on the um, rear view mirrors there and checking out the back it's going to be the lighting setup up there seat partition is going to be the pro guard taking a look at the inside which that is the pro guard there See if I can get this door to stay open for you. It's a little tricky. All right. So that's gonna be the inside. As you can see, there is a laptop in there. So not nothing too too fancy. The um, slick top over there looks the exact same on the inside. So I went all out with the lighting on this one. Of course, as everybody knows, I like to have a lot of lights and I like the lights to be pretty much on point. So coming into stage one. Let's see, I would like to turn the headlights off. Um, we just have traffic advisors in the back. Lighting stage two. Full lights in the front. Let's see if we can turn those halo lights off to stop blinding everyone. There we go. All right, and then lighting stage three, of course. So this is everything right here, like all of the lights on looks amazing so <laughs> like I said I tried to get as close as I could to the real deal so um, I did add a little extra I don't think some of the guys use too too much of the interior lights but um, every now and then I'll see them with it so And as you can see, the, um, the mirrors, they're flashing on the mirrors as well. Having decided to turn the spotlight function on and off, I kind of like it just being off. I just like the look of it, but tell me what you think. Um, oh yeah, there is another option here too. So you can turn just those two on can turn that off and also you can go pretty much so if you're on a traffic stop and you want to blind them um, this would be good to use right there so that's a really good function basically you know if you're on a traffic stop and you want to alert traffic to the back that you know that way they can still see the blue lights there but then you know so I'm gonna use that function a lot especially with the uh, other guys <laughs> and then of course you can still turn your lights on here 
Four lights. The, the traffic advisor. You do have the option to turn that off. Like I said, this is still with the high beam lights on here. So, just imagine a cold fire takedown like that. <laughs> Then you can turn those off. And you can also turn off the traffic advisor and just have the straight lights. Alright, so that's pretty much that car there. Uh, not gonna stay too long on that one. I want to showcase this one here. Another fantastic car, in my opinion. Um, I put a lot of work into this one as well. Lighting stage one. Nothing. Lighting stage two. like the other one and light in stage three four lights And as you can see, that is the Tahoe that um, I created as well. Um, I never did get the chance to show y'all that texture, but I finally did finish that texture. And it looks really good. Shout out to MPD. But um, thank you for watching. Like, rate, subscribe, and um, I'll see you guys in the next video.